Hello everyone and welcome back to the Sims 400 baby challenge. So we got ourselves a chauffeur last night. We left the house around 11 and we have just now arrived at our hotel. It is almost 5 in the morning but luckily um, since Malcolm decided to get a chauffeur we're not tired at all because we got a good amount of sleep in. So, our hotel we're staying at has a restaurant available for people to eat at. It also has a nice little sauna and yoga room to relax at and some workout stuff. It has some outdoor tables and entertainment. And then upstairs it has a little arcade game for if you're bringing kids or anything like that. Um, some beautiful balcony areas, little lounge rooms. And then it has a couple of bedrooms up here. It looks like um, the mixologists and chefs and waiters and stuff are enjoying it. But I thought that since, you know, we've just arrived at our hotel, we should definitely enjoy a little bit of woohoo with our new wifey poo. And maybe catch up on a few more Z's before we get ready for the rest of our day. Um, we'll probably get breakfast here, and then Malcolm has this awesome place that we're going to be going to. It's so cool, you guys. So, yes. Share some insecurities. We might have to do that with her. If she's okay with that. But first, let's enjoy a quick little woohoo session. Is there a pool, too? Was that like a pool out there I just saw? No, that was... Wait. There is a pool! <gasps> cool! There's also... Okay, so this level is like the arcade room and pool area. That's awesome. So excited. Alright. Let's enjoy a little bit of fun with our new wife. Let's definitely enable that. Because it's totally a flirty vibe. And if you guys want this, um, this is technically a restaurant, which works fine. You can just stay the night here if you want. Um, if you guys want to know the name of it, I can bring that up for you. I'll just do that now because I'm sure a lot of you guys actually would want to know this. This is a really cool hotel. So we are currently at Hotel and Restaurant Louisville. Um, It's one of the... I searched hotels in the um, popular now category, and it was one of them in there. But yes, let us enjoy. It looks like we have a personal mixologist up in this room instead of downstairs, which is fine. We will enjoy it just the same. The interesting thing, though, is a lot of the waiters are just kind of chilling up here. <laughs> but I think when you like go downstairs, they'll like teleport down there because that's what seemed to have happened <clears throat> what's this great for atmosphere oh it's a party place okay so we're just going to catch up on a few more z's because you know sleeping in a car is never that fun and um i'll have him actually take off work for the day so that we can go to the super awesome place i want us to go to So we will take a vacation day. <laughs> and he's going to grab a quick shower. And she is going to go downstairs and grab a table for them. Because they're going to grab some breakfast. Alright, good. We got the day off. He's grabbing a shower. Oh, our waiter just became suddenly very underdressed. This is a super fancy hotel. I enjoy it. It's really nice. Okay. Um, Annalie, you need to change your outfit. <laughs> you can't go downstairs in your nightgown. That is just highly inappropriate. And then I'll just have him, like, make his way down here. Is that Bella Goth? Are we about to show... Oh, that's Luna. Oh, Luna and Blaze are here. That's super awesome. 
Um, I need her to change her outfit before more people witness her dressed like this. We'll go with this one. Ooh, oh no, Clara saw Cl Clara. See, that's how you're supposed to spell Clara, Jade. Jesus, you should see the spelling I made for my. Oh, it's just bad for the baby Clara. It's just bad. I don't even know why I thought it was okay to spell it that way. Where is our table? I. This one? Okay. No? This one. Alrighty. Good to know. Malcolm, come sit. What? Okay, I guess we have to add him to our group, maybe, if that will work. And as you can see, I guess I still have the eyelashes on this outfit. <laughs> Whoopsie daisy. Malcolm, click on you. Malcolm, stop it. Come here. Ooh, the sun is on me, and I am really hot. Oh my god! Make me freaking throw a fit, Jesus. Where's even... Then give up the fucking table, you jerk. Malcolm, you prick. You're the one who actually needs food. So please add him to the group and then let's request a stupid table. Do we want to sit there or outside? I think we want to sit outside, but they're all like big tables and I kind of don't want to do that. I guess we'll sit in these romantic little tables here. Oh, Clara, so nice to see you. Hmm. I don't even think we actually know her. I think we've just heard about her from other people. So we're just going to do an enchanting introduction. Except not because I don't want to get flirty with her. But we're going to pretend it's enchanting. <clears throat> Where's my husband? He's going to make me throw a fit. Oh, he's talking to his son. That's alright. You may do that. Gosh, Blaze, you look and fly. He's so attractive. Where is this room? Oh, okay. <laughs> He's going all the way up here. Ooh, we should have requested like that table. I kind of want to. Annalie, will you like request that table for me? It's too late, but I like wish she would. Oh well. Please give me the table. <laughs> Sit together. And order some food. It is 9 o'clock. That took an, a horribly annoying amount of time. Malcolm, I am incredibly upset with you. Incredibly upset. Is he at least coming? Okay, so now they're on a flirty date, so it's okay. <clears throat> um, we definitely need something a little hot after that, Jesus. He's gonna have himself a healthy green tea. And we're gonna have a nice little espresso. And then, what should we have to eat? Da, 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 da. He's definitely going to have some delicious pancakes. And uh, I think she'll have some spinach fajita. Or free, for, yeah, free, whatever. Okay, or we could do volcano pasta actually. Because then we can learn the recipe. And then instead he'll have the spinach thing. Okay. 
Let's do that. <coughs> he actually wants to have himself some nectar. But he can wait till we get to where our next adventure is going to be. Alright, good. Emily has successfully introduced herself to Clara. So we at least know her. And now we can tell a nice little dirty joke to our husband about the fun we had this morning. God, but Jordan is looking so sexy right now. Malcolm. What are you doing? I kind of want to talk up a Jordan just because I'm mad at my husband and he looks so hot. Maybe she should just excuse herself from the table. Ooh, comedy level five. Yes, boo. You're upgrading yourself. She wants to have a little bit of fun in the sauna. You know what? I think she's going to go freshen up. You know, just kind of freshen up herself a little bit. And, um... She's just going to come over here. Well, she's actually having some fun with her husband. She, But she's going to be like, oh my god, it's so great to see you. Aw. But, like, stop talking to everyone else. Stop talking to everyone else. And, um, just, like, call Bajoran over. Be like, oh, it's so great to see you. I haven't seen you in forever. Oh, yeah, that spa is amazing. I hope I see you again sometime. It was so nice. You look so handsome. You kind of remind me of this one author. He's amazing. If you haven't heard of him, you definitely need to. You look amazing. Let me just say that one more time. He's flirting with his wife in front of us. We're about to get jealous. Ooh. We're gonna have to... Get him for that. <laughs> we'll definitely get him back for that. Are they, like... What are they talking about that's like so violent? He's probably because he's a jealous sim, so he probably doesn't even like that she's talking to him at all. But we're gonna continue talking to him because we want to. I'd like to request a massage from him if I could, honestly. Because then that would get them alone. But I want them to, like have their breakfast. What is going on with those two? It looks like they're fighting, but then they're like, relationships not going down. Ooh, I think he is upset that she's talking to him, like, straight up. He is jealous! For no reason, just because- I know him so well. You may go potty, sir. Just please go to the bathroom before you pee yourself. I'm not dealing with that. Ooh, and now she's really angry with him. Don't be mean to him just because you're angry. Because your husband's unreasonably jealous. I think what you should do instead... Is go... I want to, like, bring him over here so he's not by his wife. So, like, I'm gonna have her... Aw, I wish I could go to Geek Heart with her. We'll have to call her sometime soon. She's kind of being a dick because she's in a bad mood. So I'm trying to, like, make them not lose relationship because of that. But she's jealous because he flirted with his wife in front of her. So, like, she's not particularly happy about that. But don't worry. We'll make it all okay. I wonder if we're ever going to get our food, too. <laughs> Doesn't seem like it. Call him over. It looks like we're not even actually going to make it to the other half of our day today. So... <laughs> That might be for, like, tomorrow. 
actually he's moving let's follow him because he's moving away from his wife so I'm just gonna watch where he goes and then teleport to there because we're gonna pretend that she's following him all right you know what actually no we're just gonna eat our breakfast because this is our freaking meal so I would like to actually get to enjoy it <clears throat> now that everyone's done throwing whatever little fit they were throwing for some reason and we can enjoy our breakfast we can flirt with Bajoran a little bit later she's like I don't even want to sit here anymore I want to move away from my jerk of a husband so I think what we're going to do is we're going to postpone the little yacht party we were planning. Oh, I like just give away what we're doing, but whatever. And um, Malcolm's going to probably take a nap because he's exhausted and he's just doesn't really want to be by Anna Lee right now because he knows he's being irrational. So he's like, I'm just going to take a step back and calm down and then I will, um, and then we can continue our day. I know I'm being irrational. I'm really sorry, but... I just love you so much and I don't like seeing another guy talk to you even if it's just friendly conversation she's like sweetheart I understand I I understand I wouldn't like to see you talking to another girl even if I know it was just like talking so it's okay we can continue our day after you've had a little nap and rested yourself for the day so we're gonna do that and, um, she is going to hunt down Bajorn, who happens to be right here. Well, isn't that just perfect? What? Ooh, she's pissed, so she can't flirt. I hope that goes away soon. How long till she's done? Alright, she'll be done by the time she's done eating. She'll be done being pissed. Well, he just ruined this day by being such a jerk. Oh, my daughter. Walking around naked. She gets it from her mother. Um, if you excuse me, I'm going to take this outside. I need to calm down too. All of my children are naked. That dress that I got rid of, like, literally, I had everyone wearing. So, <laughs> I wonder if he'll give us a little massage to help calm us down. Do you think he'd be okay with doing that for us? Give us a little foot massage. Actually, no. It's fine. Me, I want him to give us a foot massage, though, honestly. Not a real massage, just a little foot massage. Jeez, Malcolm. I guess he didn't sleep on the car ride like Annalie did. I don't know why not. He really enjoyed his tea. So I was... I think it just makes him, like, happy. Okay, good. Da-da-da-da, da-da. Aw, oh, sweetheart. Why didn't that work? Hmm. I think it's just that she shouldn't be talking to people when she's angry. But this should be done, you know? Her anger is, like, just about done. So I'm going to have her... Express confusion over what she's eating. And... Uh, <coughs> oh, awesome, okay. What's that music? 
talk about some more writing because he's just such the perfect guy to talk about writing with. <coughs> now that we're um, flirty, let's get a little bit of flirt on. We're going to beguile him just straight up. Interesting taste. It's a work of art. I should have known. Oh, nope. It's Jeffrey. He didn't see anything actually happening. It should be okay. But if things don't work out with Majoran, we can still get our kicks on with uh, Jeffrey. We're a naughty wife. <laughs> Can't leave us alone for a second. And if you do, we're still do it right on in front of you. Stop! You're not inappropriately angry, so make that go away. <coughs> so now he's got us our number for our nice little booty call. Why'd she lose romance with some- oh no. Okay, good, we're just talking, so uh, Nancy's not seen us do anything inappropriate. But apparently this restaurant- Hotel is really popular because there is a lot of people who is here. And I don't, I didn't know it was so popular, but good to know. Give him a little sexy pose. I will make out with him. Ooh, baby, just you wait. Give him a little bold pickup line. Just be like, ooh, you want to take this for a ride? Oh my god, Jade, you're too much. Shh, I never said anything. I don't know what she's doing. She's asking a risky question. I didn't ask you to ask that, you jerk. I thought it was the more option, if I'm going to be honest. Sweet talk him. Yeah, see, I don't know why we lost, like, a bunch of options. Hey, I actually, um, had you do something? Just so you know. I'm getting weird options here. I don't really know why. They keep, like, changing a lot. I am so hot. Okay, Malcolm's still asleep. Just make sure that stays that way. Yay, he got paid for his day off. Okay, now it's suggestive again. Good. Let's blow a kiss. Attempt to seduce him, definitely, because that is what we're doing. I definitely want him to be our next baby daddy. Or maybe we'll, like, keep him on the low, like, go out on dates with him and stuff. <gasps> Let's, like, go out on dates with him and he'll, like, actually be our side boyfriend because he's got money. See? See? She's thinking the way I am. She's like, I want a new sports car. And this guy, I think he'll give it to me. Awesome. Okay. Let's kiss his neck. That'll definitely get him. I would like to schedule a date with him, but I, like, can't at this time. So, in the future, we'll definitely be going on dates with this guy. We won't ask him to be our boyfriend yet, though, because that's way too soon. Let's go woohoo in the sauna! That's what I've been waiting to do. Mmm, rawr. <laughs> oh, poor Malcolm. He has no idea what he's got himself into. I just itched. My damn sunburn again. Shoot me. Oi. Okay. Ooh. He's ripped. Ooh, we should have had him be our husband. We made a mistake. But he'll be our side boo. I like that. I think she should have a husband, an official side boo, and then just get pregnant with a bunch of other guys as well. 
Oh my gosh. Okay, guys, we're going to end this part here. And actually, when we pick up, we can go to our next destination because it can we can go there for like a night party. It doesn't have to be early in the day. So that is what we will be doing in the next part. And then we might be heading home, I think. I don't know. We'll see how many days we end up on our honeymoon. But yeah. So this day didn't go as expected and Annalise found a new uh a new side side thing to play with but i love you guys so so very much i hope you enjoyed this part if you did give it a like and um subscribe i mean why not all right i will see you guys in the next video bye bye